true joke. I mean, it's not true, but I, I, I had read in the paper that Caitlyn Jenner was contemplating posing nude in an upcoming issue of Sports Illustrated. And I know it's not politically correct to say these things, so I just figured, fuck it, I'll say it for everybody else. <laughs> Yuck. <laughs> oh, sometimes I just want to read some stats. I don't know why you're gonna cram some man pussy in the middle of the sports page like this. I just didn't think that was the place for it. But I wasn't saying anything like Caitlyn Jenner's a bad person. I'm not mad at her for doing it. I'm not even mad at Sports Illustrated. If I'm mad at somebody, I'm probably just mad at myself. You understand? Because deep down, I know that I am not strong enough to not look at those pictures. <laughs> And I don't think I'm ready to see what she's trying to show me. <laughs> so, Caitlin, God damn it, if you go through with this thing, bitch, you better go hard or go home. <laughs> I want you to go all the way. Hustler style. Do you know what hustler style means, miss? That means spread the lips. I hope she spreads her lips and there's an itty bitty dick inside. Ah! <laughs> the show is behind the curtains. <laughs> I don't know what I said that upset that person. <laughs> but I'm gonna tell you something. When I read that letter, and the moments after I read it, I did something that many black men in America do not have the time or the money to do. I thought about how I felt. <laughs> I asked myself a very basic question that I don't think I ever directly contemplated. I said, man, Dave, if you're writing all these jokes, do you have a problem with transgender people? And the answer is absolutely not. The fuck do you guys think I am? I don't understand all the choices that people make, but I do understand that life is hard and that those types of choices do not disqualify you from a life with dignity and happiness and safety in it. <laughs> <laughs>